Hello and good evening. My name's John. We're here playing Pixel Junk's Nom Nom Galaxy as part of my Steam cleaning series where I go through every game in my Steam library. Eventually, then I'm actually rate and or review them at a wee bit of playtime. Now, I have played some of the Pixel Junk Galaxy before. I played a co-op round with a friend. Uh, this game is soup-based. It reminds me a little bit of the City Builder, not City Builder, um, Terraria Minecraft, just cons construction game. Uh, you are trying to run a corporation that makes soup to take over the world or the universe. Uh, aliens want a variety of soups, and it's your job to provide them. Make soup, Astro Worker. Go, go, Astro Worker. There's not a very good Astro Worker union, to be fair. I have played... No, I play this game on a different computer. Alright. Corporate Conquest. So I have played this before, but it looks like a fresh game here, which is fine. So the way this works is you are a little robot astro worker. You always seem to crash land. Life's tough. Sorry about the bumpy landing. Honestly, I'm laughing. Your Robo Sancho... First day, we need to get some market share. We gotta find our bus saw. Go, go. As you can see, we got little tiles. We got mushrooms. Do a little parkour in there. Oxygen meter. Somewhere. Oh, there it is. Pick up. Now we can dig on through. One thing I like is um, you can click the stick to keep the saw blade out. Makes it nice and easy to go through large areas. And as they said, they want us to collect the matter because we need matter to build. A little noisy to leave that thing running, but I guess that's life. Our robots or astro workers do need oxygen, which is what the sparkly areas there provide. Ladders. A quick build a ladder. Going. A little air heart there. Very cute. Things will collapse. You made it! Soup machine. You're gonna build a soup machine. We're gonna build. Soup rocket. We're gonna build a tunnel. Now we can anti grab down this hill. And then water so I don't take damage. The jumping to be a little not awesome. I'm glad there's so much floating. Ingredient. All right. Let me need to get one more ingredient. Surprised there's no steam cloud for this. There's our market share. Not doing super great. We 
You can't uh, break the uh, brown blocks yet. I think you can later. Gotta beat up the tomatoes. They are an ingredient. Alright, so we got ourselves an ingredient. So it's all a little slow doing it by yourself, but what I think makes this game most interesting is the automation. Also, split screen co op is really nice. Again, I think this game, if you have multiple copies, you can play uh, four player. Or I should say, you can play. Um... Well, it's four player, but you play on different screens, obviously. We made a soup! To a mushroom soup! Make the soup, filling up the can. Got our can. We've delivered our soup. That's how you deliver soup. That's the market. They love it. still going. Uh, shot, shot tower. Rival Soup Company! Bots. I think land and then um, blow up. A little bit of tower defense, a little bit of building and mining, a little bit of soup. Come on, a little closer. Oh no, one got in. You. You don't belong here. Our little robot friend there got on a corn. We don't have to do anything. There's one more robot pig? Thought I got it. No, it's not there. Tutorial? Did we bug out our tutorial? One negative I have about this uh, game is that in the day shift turnover, all your ingredients on the ground apparently... Uh... Oh, well, there he is. And our last soup's gone up there. And... We've done it! That's a bit of the, uh, a bit of the uh, tutorial there. Alright, we're gonna make ourselves some soup here. So, yeah, it does seem like a lot going on. It is. So what we're gonna do... Spent our first morning doing a little digging. We need to get our mass values up. Plant some crops. Just a little setup, a little setup on the first day. Up. Oh, 
all these planted. I don't know. Alright, so now that we have... Oh, I'm a low on oxygen. So I need to bring up this and get our office planted down. Alright. Here. All right, so what do we do? Well, we can now get a Freddy who likes to throw stuff up and down. Research. Girder, conveyor belt. We don't have a, the two robots that actually... Charles and Charles. Okay. We are going to take advantage of the Freddy. We're going to make ourselves order. Like so. We're going to go down this way. One. Another one. Oh, not enough. So now that we have a robot friend, there, and now put ourselves, oh we don't have the money, that's what it is, right. put ourselves a Freddy there, if we were to put a thing there, Freddy's going to pick it up for us, isn't that nice of you Freddy? So that's our Freddy there. We need to have oh a suit machine. Suit machine. Now we're gonna put some rockets over here. Let's get our infrastructure set up. easy enough to solve. There's lots of different uh, spinning plates here of tasks and goals. Research. All this mass. All that mass. All right. Not the most strongest day one I've ever had. That's okay. We're up against an AI that doesn't seem to mind one way or the other. Rocket. First suit made. Green of Mushcrash.
these. These. Moon Brew, Mono Brew. doing this wrong I should be really uh having the robots do my my work but I bought the wrong thing to start Soup here. Come on now. Oh. Need some money at least. bit of money. Here, and we're gonna buy ourselves some robots. We're going to buy a Charles and Charles. We're gonna buy ourselves. These guys are long, but as you can see, they are building our soups for us. Here, another mushroom brew. And I think we'll get our power plant built. All right, we got a couple soups going. Uh, infrastructure. Plant. I need to get a power gem. Is 
attack. Come on. Will you throw this up and will the buddy bots? No. Alright, incoming enemies. Stop breaking my stuff. So I need to get some more resources. Alright, we need a soup. This up. This up. Alright, so now that I have a lot of ingredients. Take us all out. Now I can purchase another Charles and Charles. And I can build. Where's my. these a robot should be carrying our stuff around We need our soup rocket? No, they're going. The little robots help automate our stuff, which is very handy. It's break time. So one thing about these levels is they do take quite a while. Uh, this is me playing single player. I'm gonna play multiplayer. It's a lot faster because you just had more people doing. Let's get one more.
Needed a bit of a break. Nicely or not? Up, throw, up, throw. All these over there. So I need to get some more mushrooms up there. Our mushroom farm here. Alright, we want a corridor. We want a corridor. Here, we want... Charles and Charles, and we want corridor here. Corridor. Corridor here. We want uh, Freddy, and then we just tear all this up. Build the Charles and Charles, and they're going to just deliver stuff to the Freddy. Alright, so now they're going to get all those ingredients up. Now he's going here. We can sell this. Optimize their route. Now they're getting ingredients. Ingredients are coming. They're working. So I think all the ingredients on the ground here are going to disappear, which which is a bummer. Yeah. Keep your soup at least.
Don't worry, Charles and Charles and Charles. I'm gonna come in with ingredients. Alright, well, this there. Grab this. Moving that. Where's the other? So I need vines and wheat. So you guys... So that's gonna get us a lot of vines. We need some wheat. Where was the space wheat? Running over here. The vines. Maybe not. Well, there's some. Okay. Uh, conveyor belt. I'm not going to harvest those until... Until the day turns over. We're making progress, though. Alright, day five. Space sweet. We're low on factory power.
We're doing okay. Alright, we're close to the end. Need that for some air. Stop chomping my stuff. Alright. Bring this guy up here. Alright, we need mushrooms. Wait, it says there's still two more. Well, there's one. Making soup. Wasn't completely expecting that, but. Should be some mushrooms in here. Oh no, oh there they are. Mushroom delivery! Thing to use with these mushrooms. Hmm. Well, looks like we have to get one more day out of here. Gotta last the entire day though.
Maybe some ingredients stick around. It's hard to say. It doesn't seem like it. Oop, oh, no, not you. I don't have enough soup rockets, that's the problem. I've got enough soup to be ahead of the game. I don't think you all have anything to do. Alright, so if I make another soup bean... And I say... Mush potage. Actually, I need wheat. stuff will roll on down. Our robot buddies will be able to take advantage of it. Alright. Uh... So yes, it's not very effective to do this all yourself, but we're just trying to wait out the day, so I'll accept it for now. That'd be a lot more complex if you were running four players. A lot more things you can build and automate. A lot to go on for one player. This is just like one of the, the second stages and it's already like, you know, managing five robots and all sorts of different wild things. Shipping 34 cans of soup delivered. Charles and Charles's are, are delivering stuff, waiting for rockets to appear. We're good to go. Every time we clear a level, we get new science. Every time we get new science, we get new automation. We can make things easier. Um, there you go. Up starts. Now we can carry two ingredients at once. And there you go. And it expands and expands and expands and expands. If you go to the database here. Oh, sorry. Where do I go? We go back. Restro. Yes, there we go. So you can see 
There's a lot of recipes. There's at least 12, 14 ingredients. There you go. Uh, this has been Nom Nom Galaxy. I, I think it's a bit slow for single player. Just too much going on and a lot of things to cover for, like getting back to base and defend, or making sure your all your robots in the right place. Um, I do think that if you play multiplayer, it's really strong, and that's that's where I recommend if you can if you can swing it. But um, really cute idea and a lot of complex systems working together. So, Pixel Junk presents Nom Nom Galaxy. Cheers. <laughs>